What if there are three types of people? Subtractors, adders and multipliers. Which one are you? What if the subtractors, you know the ones, the so-called friend, the online ranter, they leave you feeling depleted, they take your energy? What if the adders, whenever you connect with them, they leave you feeling hopeful, energised, even in times of crisis? They're the ones who ask, what if? What if the multipliers? They also ask, what if? But they go a step further. Their choices, their actions, not just their words. Dare you to believe in yourself. Breathe life into your dreams. What if in these times of extraordinary change, as old ideas topple, prejudices are exposed, and our climate teeters. The world needs multipliers. It needs us to be our best selves. But how? What if optimism, hope that is grounded in honesty and action, is at the heart of being a multiplier? What if we remember Nelson Mandela's wisdom after spending 27 years in prison when he said part of being optimistic is keeping one's head pointed towards the sun, one's feet moving forward? What if Mark in Georgia chose to keep moving forward, to use lockdown to shed his inner subtractor and to lose more than three stone? What if Jenny in Maryland chose to use this time to be an ambassador for peace, to speak out about the kindness of strangers, the good in us all? What if Marcus in Manchester chose not to feed the status quo of inequality, but to ask what if he could help put food on the plate for more than 1.3 million children. What if? What ifs are not nice to haves, they're must haves. As our reality is changing ever more rapidly, so at the same time must our ability to conceive and adapt to new possibilities. What if 2020 has taught us that anything is possible, but we must choose our path before it is laid out for us? What if it's time to let go of the subtractors in our lives and choose to be a multiplier? To inspire our children through our own example, not to follow society's path of possibilities, but to follow our own dreams and to ask time and again, what if?